what's going on guys all right so today we're going to be reviewing uh, the new Kaiweets meter for my buddies at Kaiweets they sent me uh, the their newest meter and I've been using it for a couple weeks and I'm going to show you uh, what it's all about all right so this is it this is the uh, the new HT208D uh, clamp meter and from the other meter that I had the cheap one that's uh, only cost you about 20 bucks this is a huge upgrade and to be honest with you I use I usually use field piece for pretty much all of my uh, electronic type tools but this thing right here has been uh, fantastic so let's get it opened I went ahead and put it all back in the package so you could see how it looks when you get it um, it's in a it's in a nice box and with this one you get a case with it And I've already put the leads on it. So let me get this thing unwrapped real quick. All right, so there it is. So it also comes with your uh, the probes for your temperature and you'll get a booklet. So one of the major differences I love with this one is it's got the silicone leads. So it's very pliable or they're, uh, they're those really nice leads. I took the caps off of them. They, they also come with caps on them but these leads are great um, so the meter itself and I'm telling you this thing feels good it's it's heavy and it has a rubber all of this uh, bumper is rubber and it feels very nice it's got a lot on the uh, the end of it that you can turn on by right here you'll hold that down and your light will come on so let's go through the functions so you have your two amps that you can use your clamp for then you get your voltage it's got your ohms and um, microfarads on there um, and then this it's got its own separate function for the the temperature and the other cool thing I, th I think is really cool is it always gives you the temperature of what it is the ambient temperature so let's see like even when you're doing your voltage or whatever at the top it'll have your your ambient temperature outside it's really cool all right so use a couple functions and I'll show you I really like the display on this one it's uh, it's got the black background to it and it really pops um, no matter when you're using it. like the one thing with my other meters I use is you have to hit a light button just to see it when it's uh, darker but with this one it's all you can always see it very well it's a really good feature um, other thing I like you can wrap your leads up and you got your clips in the back where it holds your your test leads very well in there so that's really nice too I really like that but overall this thing I think it's fantastic I'm not being paid to talk about it um, but my own honest opinion I would recommend anybody to get this meter as a nice meter it's just a nice meter um, so I'm gonna try it out on a couple things show you how it works and uh, let's get started all right so, so this meter is also it is a true RMS which is a good thing um, and it, you, you also have the inrush inrush capability as well um, the other thing I didn't mention before that I really like um, is your leads they are super long like you have really long leads where you can sit it down on the ground and still be able to reach whatever you need to reach um, it's, it works very well. Um, so let's get started. I'll go ahead and read the amperage on these strip heats and see how it how it's reading. All right, so we'll move it to our amps. So right now the strips aren't running. And you have to go from DC to AC. So now we're in AC love the display on it. Alright, so our strip heat's just kicked on. Alright, so right here we're going to be showing you the NCV, the non-contact voltage. It's where you'll use your meter and you'll just get it close to something that has power and it'll tell you if it's hot or not. There you go, it gets to, close to the box, it turns red and you'll see the H come up. That means it's detecting it has power on it. 
and on this next one we're going to be testing resistance uh, so we're going to check the resistance between the uh, contactor to see what it reads so you put one on each end when you unplug your wire and this one is reading around 17 and a half on the resistance so the the next one we're going to do after this is the checking a capacitor checking the microfarads and seeing what um what it reads so we've taken it off the herm side and we're going to check the herm and see what it what it should be reading and it's a 30 and it's reading 29.7 all right guys so just went over a few different functions on on what it how it looks how it works um but overall with the review this thing is jam up i really like it and i'll probably continue using it um just because i mean the quality even feels good so um, you wouldn't think that this was a fairly affordable meter, but it is. You can get it on Amazon, and I put it in the description below. I believe this model is like the high-end model. I believe it's like it's only like eighty dollars, so it's a really good price for um, for a meter this nice. If I had to pick any cons with it at all, the one thing would probably be not having a magnet on the back I really like the field pieces having magnets this one doesn't have one but it sort of makes up for it by having such long leads I mean if I had to guess things probably four foot long leads so I mean it makes up for it with the leads but uh, if I had to pick something that I didn't like it would be not having a magnet but besides that I hadn't really been able to find anything I don't like about it um, and it seems really accurate. Um, I've checked it alongside other meters and it, and it tests just fine with everything else. Uh, my favorite part is probably the background. It's, you never have to have any type of light with it. it um, and it just really looks good too. I like pretty much everything about it. So, highly recommend getting this thing. All right, guys, so that's it with the, the Kiwitz meter. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and um, I hope you take my recommendation and try the Kiwitz meter out. Um, before, uh, about a year ago, I've never even heard of the company. So um, I don't know anything more about like how their customer service is or any of their um, the stuff that, that's that in that regard, <clears throat> but I do know that this this meter is 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 really nice it's, it's a jam up meter so if you want you can check it out uh, i hope y'all enjoyed this one and we'll see you next time peace